Hello traders, welcome to Simple Trading Style and today we are going to talk about daily stock market update and we will figure out is it still bearish reversal signal what's going on with the stock market world. Let's move to 5 rules of risk management, please read it and follow it every single trade and you will be successful. Now it's a time for Vibull. Let's start from index chart, looks like the all indexes just was on a sell off mode all day they bounced last hour last 30 minutes right <clears throat> last hour it was nice bounce but all day it was in a bearish channel now let's move to my view bull setup uh, my name is Vadik if you want to learn more about uh, view bull setup just go to the description there is the link about view bull setup training and other links about all my trainings now let me briefly mention about my setup i'm using sim simple moving averages white line ma200 purple line ma100 blue line ma50 yellow line ma20 red line ma10 and green line ma5 below macd indicator lines rsi indicator lines awesome oscillator bars that's all very simple it's not easy because emotions involved if you follow the indicators you will be successful because indicators do not have emotions like on my chart you see green line ma5 did bullish crossover over red line it was entry point for bullish trend here on the february 19 green line did bearish crossover over red line it was entry point for short for bearish and now looks like it's building bullish reversal we'll see this blue line it was support line and looks like it bounced from the support line so far setup is bearish all moving averages below 200 it is bearish setup but we'll see it needs to be very powerful bullish run to to turn all all moving averages from bearish territory to positive bullish territory above 200 so far nice reversal plus half percent today but still in a bearish territory use use today was negative we did uh yeah red bar but it's still let me maximize it it red bar but still above yellow line it is in the bullish territory all indicators already switched to bearish four hours time frame ma5 10 and bar already moved below 20 it is bearish trend last bar stopped at ma50 ma50 strong support it can bounce it did bounce from ma50 several times already bearish trend on all indicators one hour time frame last bar below ma5 10 20 50 below all moving averages except 100 it is bearish trend use in a bearish mode vxn volatility index plus four percent on daily time frame it just moved but still below ma200 still in a bearish territory SPX, SP 500, SP 500 minus quarter percent daily time frame, red bar, but still last bar above all moving averages, still bullish territory. All indicators already switched to bearish reversal signal. Four hours time frame, last bar stopped at MA20 level, a yellow line. still in a positive territory still in a positive territory all indicators they they created bearish divergences one hour time frame bearish crossover last bar ma5 and 10 below 20 bearish bearish trend now weeks weeks plus five percent nice bounce nice bounce but still below ma200 white line 
Dylan de Berrios teritori. Dow Jones. Dow Jones last bar at Serat bar, but still a bow. All moving averages still in the bullish territory. All indicators have bearish divergences. Multiple. For our time frame, same story. Last bar just stopped and finished at MA20 level. Yellow line. And RSI already switched to bearish reversal. Awesome oscillator also switched to bearish reversal. One hour time frame for Dow Jones. It was bearish. Yeah, it was bearish all day. It touched MA200 and looks like it did bounce from it. Will it continue bounce from it or it will reverse? We will see it tomorrow. So far it is bearish trend. IWM Russell 2000. Daily time frame. Last bar close below MA20 yellow line. It is bearish reversal trend for IWM. For our time frame, same story. Last bar close below MA50 bearish reversal trend. One hour. Last bar just stopped at MA one MA two hundred level white line. It is confirmed bearish trend. It can bounce from 200 to 100. It's a strong support. Apple is positive today. Let's see daily time frame. MA5 did bullish crossover over 10. It's a bullish reversal signal. Still, be still below 20, below yellow line, but signal is positive. MA50 did bearish crossover over 200. It is bearish setup. Negative setup. For hours time frame, MA5 and 10 did bullish crossover over 20, last bar about 20, bullish crossover, bullish trend. One hour time frame, same story, last bar and MA5 and 10 about 20, bullish trend. Tesla. Tesla daily time frame. Tesla daily time frame red bar still bearish trend with bullish divergences. It indefinitely Tesla wants to have some to, to change some direction to bullish. So far it is still bearish on daily. For hours time frame, similar story, bearish trend. Bullish divergence and one hour time frame, same bearish trend with bullish divergences. Nvidia, Nvidia negative today. Let's start daily. Red bar MA5 ready for bearish crossover. Nice bearish reversal. It's minus. $100 from the top. All indicators ready for bearish crossover. For hours time frame, last bar close below MA20. Yellow line. It is bearish reversal trend. One hour time frame. MA5 green line and bars and MA10 moved below 20. It is bearish trend on all indicators. Microsoft, Microsoft still bullish. Microsoft positive today. Microsoft, Amazon and Google and Apple still positive. Four stocks positive. Uh, Microsoft daily bullish trend. Uh, if you see it's a bullish trend with bearish divergence. The price action is bullish at the same time. The bearish divergence, right? On all, the, on all indicators, RSI, same story. And same story with awesome oscillator. Mm -hmm. 
bullish trend with bearish divergence. Sorry. Let me go back. Bullish trend, bearish divergence on all indicators, right? Remember, bearish divergence is not a signal, it's a condition. It means Microsoft is building bearish condition. Someday it will do bearish reversal. Four hours time frame, bullish trend, bearish divergences, same story, nothing changed. One hour time frame, bullish trend, bearish divergences, all the same. Amazon. Amazon last bar above all moving averages, still bullish trend, same story. Bullish trend and bearish divergence on all indicators. Yeah, bearish divergence on all indicators. Bullish trend. Four hours time frame for Amazon. Same story, price action bullish, bearish divergences. And one hour time frame, same bullish trend, bearish divergences. Google. Google did nice bounce from MA200 from white line. You see bounce. And yeah, just bullish trend on all indicators. Still left. Yeah, it filled this gap. It was here, gap over here. It was filled today. Will it continue to fill this gap and this gap? Or it will do reversal from MA50? We will see tomorrow. For our time frame, bullish trend. On all indicators, last bar above all moving averages. One hour time frame, also bullish trend on all indicators. MA5, 10 and 20 did bullish crossover over 200. It is bullish trend. Meta, daily time frame. MA5 did bearish reversal. On daily time frame, it touched MA20. It can bounce from MA20 because 20 strong support. Huge gap below for Meta, but still in the bullish territory. For hours time frame, MA5, 10 and bars below 20. It is bearish reversal trend. One hour time frame, same story. MA5, 10 and bars below 20 and 50. Bearish trend. That's all. That's all from my uh, end. Let's from my review. Let's do summary. Uh, yeah, Meta is bearish, bullish Google, Amazon, Microsoft, and Apple. Everything else in the bearish reversal trend on one hour time frame. On daily, all indexes still positive, still bullish in equities, but on one hour time frame, they all already. Started bearish trend on one hour time frame, and some of them also started on four hours time frame bearish trend also. But on daily, they all still in the bullish territory. That's all. That's all from my side. Let's move to disclaimer. I am not a financial advisor. This video for educational and informational purposes only. Remember, for educational purpose, we are using a paper training simulator. Thank you for watching simple trading style videos. I do publish daily, weekly, monthly updates for stocks, ETFs, indexes, and cryptos. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel. Click like button to support this channel. I really appreciate all your efforts. Thank you so much and good luck. Bye now.